Hey GTI fans, welcome back to another episode of Journey of Life. And we had the lathe set up and got some iron tools. You can see I got my uh, felling axe on me and we made a bunch more tools. I made some chests off camera. So here's the rest of the tools. I made a shovel. Um, so that's the max digging. It's not the mass digging chance, just the max digging, so it digs it up really fast. I don't care about the chance so much. Uh, just well, the chance isn't bad too. Anyway, um, but it's the only shovel that actually I can put the handle and the shovel head on that actually works. It seems to be the only combo to build a shovel with. So you get what you get with that one. It's kind of here. Let's pick that up and move it so it's not like halfway into the. Can we do it so it's just laying down? flat there we go okay and then we have our plant felling axe so it has a special the forest axe top type 2 with the handle that I found with the most damage to plants and that was the so we end up with a decent damage to plants not very good on trees so this will chop down I mean it'll chop down trees but it's like you know 14 15 times like the wood axe is really but but if up against shrubbery, it's like four hits, goes down. Um, then we have our builder's hammer. So just a very basic uh, straight handle with the square top style um, hammer head. It's the best for building, at least I've found so far. And uh, it's going to be my main i'm just you know what i'm going to pick that up right now and just have it in my secondary slot because it's it's the probably the most used tool in the game <laughs> is that hammer okay uh you think it was going to be the axe but no it's not actually the hammer you use the hammer quite a bit okay today we're going to work on the mill i don't think we're going to get it built uh, because I want to put it onto a platform. And um, I know the sawmill isn't part of the first phase of the settlement. But I I want to get the sawmill up before I build any more buildings. Because it's just, oh, it's so much more efficient to get planks going. So what we're going to do is, oh, actually I don't need to do that. Okay, what we're going to do is... We're just going to lay it out. So let's, let's get up here. Okay. So it's a pretty flat area. Now this is going to be pretty much permanently where it's going to be. So I really want to kind of think about this. I really want to kind of think about this. And then the other, I mean, the trees, chopping the trees down is no big deal. Um, it's a fairly large flat area around here. And the bushes, none of that will grow back once, once I put bases up. Okay. You know what? Let's do it here. Let's do it here. We'll try and get it to lift up a little bit on. We could put it off to the side and try and get it to lift. Sometimes these plants will help get the base lifted. Like I, I'm not sure how to raise the elevation on stuff. I don't want birch or birch and this is what I want, wood. Okay, see how it's kind of trying to jump up on us? There we go. There we go. That's what I'm looking for. Oh. Something like that. There we go. Yeah, we'll have a nice height to it. So, you first lay out kind of the blueprint, so to speak, of the building, or each block section, and then you build it. Okay, it's going to have to be wide enough to, <clears throat> excuse me, to put up the... Um, The mill, that's not going to be long enough either. So we got to go four by three. Okay, 
Yeah, it looks we, we we should be able to do it with a four by three. We might have to do something a little bit longer, like a five by three potentially. Okay. Uh, we can always expand it out later. Um, so from this end, we're gonna have to put some sort of. You know, let's put a ramp here. Is that already meeting? No, it's not me meeting uh, max height. That's good. Okay, ramp it up. So let's ramp it up. Yeah, like that, right there. Perfect. Okay. So let's see if we can hammer in some of this stuff. So we'll switch back to you know what? Let's let's organize our tools here. We want our felling axe in one hand and our hammer in the other, or not hand, but uh, equipment saw. So if I select one, um, there we go. It has the axe. Number two is the hammer. There we go. Okay. Okay, so we got to grab. What is it? What does this one need? This one needs. Oh, I wish the tool tip thing. Here, can we see it from there? We go. There we go. Wooden ramp requires three two meter planks and one one meter plank, and these require five two meter planks. Okay, so we only need one one meter plank. Okay, and all the rest full meter. Okay, well, we'll just pick up a, a pair of those and we'll grab all this. We'll start hammering this stuff in. So we just walk up to it and start swinging. And there we go. It's building. Yay! Our first structure going up. Here we go. We can, trop, uh, we can chop it down that tree. And that's a broad leaf. So here we go. Go like this and you can see the birch is actually dropping on the uh, platform. Stuff will fall through, but that's okay. When we actually build it and we come back from a save, it'll probably be all sitting on top, or at least that seems to be what it does. Uh, here, we can just continue to pound in what we have on us. And there, that's it. That's it. Okay. Let's throw these logs down. Well, we can just get them going as uh, planks and they'll drop for us. And then we can just grab what planks there are. Not much. Okay. So I'll probably have to spend the day building planks because this will be too slow to do one at a time <laughs> and I will be back once this is built and I have I'll, I'll get some extra planks together too so so I'm gonna go get all the stuff together build get all the uh, um, bleh, planks get the rest of this built and then I'll get some extra planks together and then I'll meet you back here and we'll get the lumber mill going I also need to craft up stuff for the lumber mill, which is going to require um, the saw blades. So I do have, yeah, I've got enough. Okay, so that's fine. Um, I will meet you back here when I go get some more lumber. Okay, I know it's starting to get a little bit late. Uh, well, actually, the sun, so it's not too bad. So I've been hacking trees, building up the platform. I've noticed I'm, I'm run, I ran out of food. Um, I think what we should actually do because of that is make a pottery station. I know that sounds crazy, but the reason is, is I need a soup bowl. I can't make a big soup pot. And, um, and we can be much more efficient with the fruits that we're picking with uh, making jam. Uh, I know how to make jam. You just throw the fruit in the boiling water and it makes jam. Not everything makes good jam, though. We'll experiment with that. But in the meantime, we got to make a...
pottery station so that we can do this, the big soup pot. Okay. So I guess we'll just do it right on the other. Let's do it on the other side here. Yeah. Flip that around. Do it up against the back of that. The two stations back to back. Where I'm going to have a bunch of probably some more benches along there. So I'll just, I can always move any, you know, I can move it, right? So straight solid six. Okay, 20 of those, rope and pottery wheel. Okay, that's easy. Oh, there's 20 right there. And where did I put the rope? Did I? Yeah, there it is. Okay. I didn't need that much. Pottery wheel. Okay, let's see what that's going to entail. Uh, is that a craftable? It sounds like a craftable. Pottery wheel. Two stone wheels and straight solid stick. Okay, so craftable stone wheel, two flat rocks. Okay, got two here. Let's just grab these. Uh, we've got the we've got another. We can smack down some of the larger sticks here to to make more solid sticks. So, okay. Um, Let's get this in place. I gotta make the wheel though. We'll get the rest of this pounded in. Okay, so we'll make the wheel. Craftable. Stone wheel. Craft that. It required two of those, right, for the pottery wheel? Yeah. And, and another stick. Okay. Okay. That's fine. We have that right over here. Do we not? Somewhere right here? No. Oh, wait. No. I. Why did I run all the way over here? I'm put the sticks over here. There we go. Okay. So now we can finish this off. Craftable pottery wheel. Okay. And we'll pound that in. There we go. So this gives us some more options. We can make a small clay pot. Um, can hold up to three liters. Good for a start. I think that that's the same thing that you can make just with the basic uh, workstation. Soup pot. So we want that seven clay. Okay. Let's get that going. Because then we're going to go, I'm going to use our new axe. I know we're deviating from the wood mill, but sorry. This is another thing that, the a, 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 no, it's not there. in this one okay okay so you can see we're getting thirsty but we've got a we've got an action plan here let's just keep going with this soup pot okay and then you know what we're gonna grab some of these smaller I'm going to grab some of those because what we're going to do now that we have the soup pot, we've got to cook that. So that's it's raw. That's fine. So we'll fire this up. Okay. Yeah, I don't know if we're going to get much of the uh, lumber mill done, guys. Sorry, but I want to show you this. I'm going to cook up some... Uh, some soup here but we're also going to make a bucket i think or two let's craft one for right now mm. 
Okay. And you guys probably noticed I upgraded the fireplace, by the way. Uh, that was an easy, quick upgrade. So let's grab the bucket and fill this up. And it takes a while to fill up. Just got to keep holding down the button. The bucket is substantially larger than the uh, than the clay cup. Okay, it's looking like I filled it. Okay, yep. So we got to put this close to the fire to get it uh, up to temperature. There it goes. It'll flip over to regular water soon. That should be baked already. Yep. There we go. We got water. Okay, so now that we got water, we can fill this up. So fill with water. There we go. So now it's got water. Okay, we've got water here. We, let's put this stuff down. We can put all this crap. You know, I'm just going to throw this down really quick. I know, I know, messy, 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 but I just need the space right now. I can clean all this up later. <laughs> we'll come back. Oh, it didn't put down. Okay, there we go. Okay. Now, I'll keep those on me. Let's grab this. We're going to go run before it gets dark. We're going to run and grab some fruits here. So this is the felling axe for, you can see I still got logs to clean up too. Um, this is the felling axe for plants. This is a plant, not a tree. So one, two, three, four, five. Five hits and it fell. So we'll just grab that and the fiber. I'll leave the sticks there for now. We're just looking for the fruits really right now. So uh, there's another one and another one here. Before it gets dark. You can see our uh, food and water reserves are getting low. Now, is there any left on the ground there? No. Let's grab the fiber. Okay. We'll grab these. I think eventually the goal is, is that I'll have settlers that could, oh wait, I didn't want to pick up this cup. Not this, that, settlers that'll come by and pick this stuff up and sort it into, uh, into pre-designated storage facilities that we build. Okay, that's good enough for now. I'm getting really thirsty before we start getting into the damage zone or the danger zone, I guess. Okay, so we've got this water boiled now, soup pot. Let's add some of these uh, khaki fruit. So we'll add a whole stack. Let's see what that did. Doesn't seem to have done anything. Let's add some more. Oh, no, there it goes, khaki jam. Khaki jam. There we go. Okay. So we can just take soup out of that now with the with this. So here we'll go like this. We um not sure what we can do. We can fill it, yeah. So we emptied ours into it, yep. And then we can take some soup. So take the soup. So now we have some khaki jam in our pot. Here, let's put that down and take a look at it. So it's real light color. It's like this. It's it's a golden kind of color jam. That's fine. Let's drink that. So we'll consume it with E. And oh yeah, it filled it filled. 
completely up everything up well that's cool um so there we go we've got a whole mm, there's none left okay so we got to make some more <laughs> but that's easy enough we just grab this right and then uh i guess we can put that to the side put that on it so this fill with water there we go and then oh what did i have it on the wrong selection okay so i want i didn't want pick up fill okay oops fill with water right there i thought i i thought i had it on that whatever uh okay so there we go we've got some boiling water again and we can throw in let's see what happens if we only put in two if it makes enough soup if it makes enough to make a whole pot right what does it do does it do anything maybe it won't do anything Uh, it doesn't appear to be doing anything with just two. Okay, so let's. Let's, uh, oops. I only want. How do you do it to just pick up one am I doing am I being retarded no that dropped it on the ground am I, I and that's a bad word sorry that's crouch 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 oh my god <laughs> didn't even realize there was you know I haven't needed to use it so I didn't bother trying that's funny um Yeah, I thought there was a way to uh, to separate that, wasn't there? What if I do the shift drag and go like this? Yeah, that's how you separate it. Okay. Um, let's do three. Oh, oh come on, really? <laughs> why? Why? Uh, okay, we'll try two. So that was a uh, four in total. Is that going to be enough to make jam? We'll see. I'm trying to be as stingy as possible to try and make the food go further. So I don't have to. Eh, it doesn't look like it's going to bake. Oh, you know what? You know what? It's because it's because we've got like no freaking heat going on here there we go there we go there we go there we go come on temperature i see you coming up there we go oh disgusting soup uh. <laughs> full right now so I don't want any of the disgusting soup <laughs> oh it's getting too dark to chop trees too oh crap okay so what I'll do is we'll let's sleep till morning so let's sleep till morning now which is cool and there we go um, that was interesting <laughs> I did like a power squat there and sprang back up and it is sunlight. Yay! Okay. So we've got our disgusting soup we can have for breakfast. You know what? We're not we're not even hungry or thirsty right now. We can we can chow down on that later. So we don't have too much in the way of planks left, so we'll get the rest of this thrown in. And you know what? I'm just going to leave this down here. Put this down. 
I don't need all that on me. <clears throat> okay. Oh, I haven't been... Uh, let's put the uh, bucket down. Don't need the bucket. Don't need this axe. Got to spin up. You know what? I'll just put it into the... Uh, it's not that one. It's not that one. What, where the heck did I put it? Again? Not that one. It'll be in the last one I looked, right? No, it's this one. There we go. You know what? I'm just going to... I'll put it in there. Whatever. I can craft it later. And I guess i got to clean up this junk, but I'll do that off camera. So let's go and grab... What I'm going to do is... To end the, uh, oh, we have all these logs in here that I still have from when I brought them over. So that's good. What we can do is let's grab all those and we'll dump those onto the saw bench. Or um, woodworks, woodwork, woodworks. Okay, so let's crank that to eight. There we go. Okay, I'm going to go show you, we're going to, I want to take this with us, so there we go, get that, I'm just going to throw this down, I'm just going to throw the rest of these planks down too, and then we're going to take this, because we're going to go on a little journey, how's this, do? oh yeah, I see tons, still hasn't even dulled yet, and I was chopping all day, it seems. It's like way different than the uh, so you get really bad uh, resolution but you can seem to run through solid things which is good which is really good like my frames just dump using this thing but oh we want to go over here I was specifically taking you guys okay let's look up and around for a second where is that there it is there's the willow it's right over here so there's a willow tree here Take you guys too. Okay. So we'll chop this willow tree down before the sun goes down. And come on. Why aren't you chopping? Come on. Switch weapons. Switch back. And there we go. It's a bit of a... I, I'm not sure. Sometimes it doesn't... Um, recognize that you have anything in your hand sometimes so you gotta like flip out and flip back in a weapon and we should have got a little bit yeah there's another log here but what it dropped was this dry grass patch and this is what we need for the roof material okay so there we go we got a little bit of dry grass patch a patch and do we have enough time no I don't think we no we don't have enough time okay so I'm just gonna chop down some, some trees in here and I think what we'll do is next episode I'll have yeah see I'm just gonna load this up with with logs and bring it all back um, put this in here too I think next episode we'll get the lumber mill built. It was too much of a challenge for me to do this episode for some reason. Uh, but we did get the pottery station built. Uh, we did get the platform built for the uh, lumber mill. But we didn't get any walls up. We didn't get the sawmill station built, which is really the, the main goal of getting the lumber mill up. So... Um, you know, but at least I showed you where we can chop down one willow tree right nearby. <laughs> okay, let's put this stuff in. And you can see how quickly this axe chops down trees compared to uh, the, uh, the other wooden axe from the start. Is that... That was probably, well, it doesn't matter. It's taking up space on me. I shouldn't have had it. Okay. Well, I'm going to continue to chop down trees. Um, and because I think this episode, it's fine if we leave it off here. I'm going to continue to get just a ton of 
trees chopped down. I'm not necessarily, necessarily going to turn it all into planks, but I'm going to turn it into enough planks to build the lumber mill. And I'll also smell, I'll make all these saw blades for the lumber mill. That's just a process of making the, a mold and going through that process of, of putting the ingots in and smelting it. We don't need to go through all that again. So um, I'm going to leave it here. And the, the sun is going to give me the rest of the day to chop down trees. I wanted to go show you where that first willow tree was for the uh, roofing material. Um, you know what? You know what? Before we finish off, I think we can run over there really quick. Uh, I'll show you. I'll show you. It's going to be a little bit of hell through the water, but I'm going to take this thing across the river. It's a little landing over here. You can get up. So there's a bunch of willows over here too. There's a couple right near the water and then there's another grove of like five of them all together um, and a couple more where are they? They're they're near the mountain and oh there's a bunch all over the place but these are the easy ones to find these these three that I'm bringing you to. Oh, there we got our frames back for a second. As soon as you move your your uh, angle that you're, oh, as soon as you turn a bit, it tanks the frames. Okay, so here's our two willow trees on this side that are easy to get to. And, uh, yeah, kind of a cool spot. It'd be kind of cool to build around here too near the, uh, near the cliffs to the, ocean um i'm not sure if you can make an elevator down i don't i think you need like two sides to prop it on i'm not sure like i think it's only going to work at the ravine so we'll have to go to the ravine and try to build an elevator eventually i think well guys i'm going to leave it here so that's how you get the willows and next episode we'll be putting installing those i'm hoping <laughs> we'll be installing the willow um i'll have enough to come on are you not going to chop really why okay is it just when i get out of the cart oh, okay seems to be just when i get out of the cart that's interesting. We'll I'll have to report that. <laughs> okay. Well, I'm going to leave it here. Um, next episode, we'll finish off the lumber mill. At least I, we should have everything ready to do that. We'll, we'll just be able to assemble it then. So, and then we'll cut up some logs, and I'll show you how much faster it is to uh, to to get construction done once you get that lumber mill going well guys hope you enjoyed the episode i'm going to take this cart back um and we'll just chop another tree on the way back oh wait i didn't chop down the other willow did i chop them both down did i get them both in one swing that was bizarre oh there it is i'm like what the heck how could i have no i'm just urban I'm just herping. Okay, guys, I'm going to call it here, and I just want to see how much we got. Ooh, that was a good one. Ooh, nine. Nine, look at that. Oh, yeah, that's going to give us, uh, that'll give us enough to put the roof on easily. Awesome. Awesome. Well, next episode, sawmill. Have a good one.